So welcome to what I think is perhaps one of the most important conferences in Southern California for individuals affected by dementia. So we're so happy to see all of you here on this lovely fall morning. Uh, believe it or not, this is now the 28th year that we have been putting on uh, this conference for the community. So this year, uh, we've decided to focus on advances as they relate to diagnosis, treatment, and prevention of Alzheimer's and dementia. And because that information is always evolving, uh, researchers, particularly those at UCI Mind, are learning more and more about the disease and obviously working very hard to try to develop innovative ways to identify and uh, treat it. And so I would invite you to learn more about these topics by visiting our table out in the uh, foyer. Uh, as you probably know, a lot of research is moving earlier and earlier in the disease process, but particularly for this year's conference, we decided to focus on the day-to-day -day challenges that individuals afflicted with Alzheimer's and other forms of dementia face. Uh, often, the topics that we're gonna cover here today are ignored. And so that's why this conference was entitled The Elephant in the Room, because generally people don't like to discuss them. So uh, we have uh, leading experts, and we're so grateful that they've taken time out of their busy day often to uh, fly here from pretty far places to talk to us about the impact of driving, elder abuse, intimacy issues, uh, neuropsychiatric uh, symptoms, as well as end-of-life uh, issues. Unfortunately, all of these plague individuals and their families. So our goal here today for UCI Mind and Alzheimer's Orange County is to shine light on these uh, very important issues to help the individuals and their families uh, as much as possible. And now it gives me great privilege to introduce our partner uh, from Alzheimer's Orange County. Uh, not quite as tall as Jim McAleer, but equal of equal stature. And that's Patty Mouton. Good morning. I may not be Jim McAleer, but I can play him on TV. <laughs> it is such a pleasure and you know, really exhilarating to see all of you here this morning. I figured out this is the 17th year that I have either attended or been part of this conference. So this is really a um, benchmark in Southern California for bringing the latest, most up-to-date, most impactful information to people who are caring for those with Alzheimer's disease, who are the clinicians, and the people themselves who are coping with the ravages of cognitive impairment. Thank you for being here. Alzheimer's Orange County is really interested in deepening our impact and our footprint in Orange County so that we can continue to improve and enhance the quality of life for all of those suffering from any form of dementia. We appreciate you being here and we so appreciate the partnership with UCI Mind. I wanna call your attention to a very special photographic exhibit out in the uh, exhibit area and out in the hallways by noted photographer Kathy Greenblatt. She has captured in so deep a way the fact that people who are living with all stages of dementia are people living. And it will be very, very moving and inspirational, especially as you go throughout this day. And we address and attack issues that are very difficult and sometimes get sidestep us from the fact that the people we care for are people. Have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for being here. It's a great honor to be able to pass things over to Dr. Josh Grill. Um, he may not be Jim McAleer, but he's a lot better looking. <laughs> ah, many things have been said about me. Never before. Uh, thank you, Patty. Uh, thank you all for joining us today. 
Um, I want to echo everything that uh, was said previously. We're thrilled that you all could join us, and we are um, deeply pleased to provide what we uh, believe is an extremely valuable resource for the, the medical professionals and the people of Orange County. Um, I'm going to serve as Master of Ceremonies this year. Um, I want to instruct you that uh, outside there are, in fact, resource tables for the incredible services provided by AOC, as well as uh, things that are happening at UCI Mind. We're extremely proud to be Orange County's only state and federally funded Alzheimer's Disease Research Center, and we have taken new steps to try to help people get matched to studies happening at UCI. Uh, especially in the form of our new consent to contact registry or C2C registry, so I'd urge you to look at those things. Um, before we begin our exciting program, I have some uh, housekeeping things to take care of. Um, I think another really important announcement is to thank all of our sponsors uh, and exhibitors at this year's conference, and as you can see, um, most of them are uh, uh, situated around the room. So during our breaks uh, and, and uh, meal uh, times, I would urge you to look at uh, the valuable resources provided by our sponsors and exhibitors. Uh, there is a directory of all of those exhibitors in your folder. Um, along with that, in your folder, there are note cards. And those note cards can be used to write down questions for our speakers. There will also be roaming microphones, but we would urge you to use the cards if you're able. And if you are the inquisitive type and run out of note cards, there are replacement note cards at the end of the tables and in the back of the room. Um, please silence your phones. Um, this is uh, going to be a very important and I'm sure rich and wonderful dialogue today. And we'd like to uh, remove any intrusions. If you haven't yet checked in at the registration, please do so to get your badge, your ticket for lunch, parking validation, and your folder. Um, and with that, I think I have completed. Ah, the program includes, uh, your folder includes a program and speaker bios and uh, today's agenda. Lastly, um, please complete your evaluations. We, we truly do look carefully at what you, feedback you provide us and try to improve this conference year after year, and as you heard, after year after year after year. So all that completed, and without further ado, um, let me tell you about our program. We have a series of wonderful speakers. We have a series of truly important topics. And we have tried something new to introduce each of these topics. Prior to each talk, you'll be shown a video that attempts to introduce you to the magnitude of the topics that we will cover. Today's first topic is driving and dementia. <laughs> 